This video is to show you how to wire up a battery for a electric scooter. A lot of these scooters are from China, so the wiring may not be uniform, like in the US where you will see black for negative and red for positive. So a lot of their batteries you might see blue for the negative but on their main harness, you may see a black and an orange. So don't focus on the colors of the wires, but more on how the wiring will go. So these are the main harness coming from the bike. It had an orange connected with a, a fuse. Every wire will not have the fuse close to where the battery terminal is. So. Do not get hung up on something that's missing. It may be somewhere else. So from the main harness of the bike, you will have two wires positive, whether it's orange or red. And most times the black will be black. Now this is called paralleling the battery. What you're, what you're doing is making the batteries as one. So whether you have a scooter that has two batteries, three batteries, or six batteries, you're paralleling them to become one battery. So when you parallel a battery, you'll notice they have red and blue, which is in the US, this will be black, positive and negative. So you're joining a positive to a negative. So when you have your run like this, this battery set up there all in a row. On some scooters, they may be, you know, some on a lower level and then some on an upper level, and some may be turned sideways. That doesn't really matter. The main thing you're trying to do is parallel these batteries to become one large battery. So with this one with four in a row, you will start from the far end leave the first one, whether it's you're leaving a negative or a positive. In this case, we're leaving uh, the blue one, which is in the US would be black. So this will be a negative. And at your end battery, you're leaving the red, which would be positive. Now in the parallel in the batteries, you're gonna join red to the next battery, blue. Then you go to your next battery that you join from that one, now you're going red again to the next following battery, blue. Then you're coming from this battery, you're going red to the next battery to blue. Then you're leaving the last one. So now when you're looking at it, you have one battery. Here's your positive, here's your negative. So now you will connect your positive terminal Bear with me because I can't hold the camera and show you at the same time. And then your negative cable. You will get a spark. That doesn't mean that you did anything wrong or wired up wrong. When the, when the power is first set up, it will create a spark leading you to believe that you wired something wrong which you have not. So now all your lights will turn on. If it was wired wrong, it will spark and keep sparking and you won't get any power. So do not be afraid of that initial spark. And that will happen if you unplug it and plug it again, it probably won't spark again. It's just the, the main computer it's grabbing a power and that's its initial spark that it will do. So remember, you're parallel in a battery. It, most people will look at it and say, it doesn't make sense. Why would you hook a positive to a negative? But when you're parallel on a battery, that's what you have to do. You have to connect a positive to a negative and then a positive to a negative and a positive to a negative to leave the two ends to create a positive a positive and a negative, and then this will react like a regular battery. You have your green terminal and your black terminal. 
And that's how you parallel an electric scooter.